What's going on YouTube? My name is Zach Sensman. Welcome to the channel. So we are back. It's day two of SEMA. And what better place to start than with the truck that I got to help work on last week. Now, if you follow me on Facebook, you would have seen a lot more. You would have seen that I posted pictures of it yesterday. But if you follow me on Instagram, I think I posted a couple of stories of some late nights working on the suspension for this truck. Now, let's just go ahead and show you guys. So this is what we were working on was paint matching the suspension. Well, not really paint matching since it's a blue chrome wrap, but it is a custom built, I believe adjustable 14 to 16 inch lift. Painted axles, painted everything. Yeah, custom painted headlights. So this is the truck uh, and it is a really great location. I'm really happy with everything. I really want to give a shout out to my man Chindo at Chindo Customs for giving me a shout and letting me lend a hand and help out on this because it's really cool to see i mean you can see behind people are checking it out it's really cool to be able to work on something and then see it out here at sema my goals and my bucket list is to build a car to come out here to sema anyways so this was just kind of like a little taste without actually having to go through all the troubles of shipping it here and everything and i didn't have a whole lot of hands on on the build but it was really fun to just be a part of it and see it out here So that's it for that, man. Let's get the day started. Who knows what today's gonna bring? So if any of y'all have seen uh, Fastest Car Season 2 on Netflix, you will have seen this was the first place winner. Mr. Justin himself with the 720. These exotics are winning all of them because I actually knew Pepper too because he's from Oklahoma. Right on. So to see him win and then to see you win. And not, so if y'all guys don't know, Atlanta Custom Wraps, I've been following him for a while. He does the killer custom camo, which is blowing up in the rap industry. So trendsetter for sure. And then to see him on Netflix, Fastest Car. And like I just told him, we just had a quick conversation. Super, super humbling to just sit and talk with someone. But... To see all your work copied throughout the industry, yeah, little mixed emotions. It, it is, it's yeah. mixed emotions, right? And, and when it's done right, I am overly humble, and, and it's, it's such a cool feeling to see yeah. and, and feel like we started some kind of trend that, that took off. So, yeah, so that's really, really great, man. And, and I've, I've learned to to accept no, it and, and own it and take and, it as a positive and take it as a compliment yeah it, it's taken me a while to do that but but i'm really happy to see it blow up and, and the fact that you know um, our creativity could help make other shops money throughout the country and and grow our industry is like the biggest blessing of all right so yeah, we all want to make nice. money and we all want to be i i did that that's yeah. my shit. and at the same time like I feel like I helped an industry a little bit, so yeah. if I can help somebody else turn a profit in another state, then right on, man. Yeah. Like, that's awesome. Yeah, so, I mean, you could, like you said, you're taking on what, four, 450 yeah, a year? 450, 400, 450 color changes a year. That's full color changes. So. Yeah, so I mean, you can only do so many a year without, that's right. you know, that's you can't right. do every state. Absolutely. But, if y'all haven't watched the Netflix series, man, he talks a little bit about his background and where he was 10 years ago, and that alone is a humbling, humbling, like, story in itself. There's like, some I've, good YouTube coverage, too, on yeah. rap Wise, some interviews I've done about okay. even further back in my past. So, so yeah, check that out, man, and, you know, you'll see, like, you don't have to start with everything. Very true, very true. I mean, you guys know I've, I rap out of the garage, so to hear what he's been able to accomplish 
it's really nice, man. And uh, again, like I really appreciate you just Absolutely. talking with me and you know, That's what it's all about, channel, man. And it, That's man what it's about. Go follow his Instagram. He's got a sick bed as well. I mean, I know y'all seen the 720, but the bed is nuts. I really wish it was here. Overkill is, is overkill. my baby. Yeah. yeah, overkill is overkill. So, okay. hey, thank you again. Thank you so uh, much, buddy. It's hard whenever I'm holding with the right I hand. Know, I can't shake I know, hands afterwards. I totally get it. But check out Rap Life. Check out Atlanta Custom Wraps. Yep. And, yeah, SEMA yep. 19. SEMA 19. So you guys don't understand how really humbling that is to stop and talk to somebody and like they'll literally just give you time man we just hung out for about 30 minutes you know before the interview and uh really down to earth guy really just open to talk and have a conversation and talk about things and hear about what i'm doing and that right there like you know i, I showed yesterday you know there's the line for chip foods and all that you know I, but i enjoy interactions like that that's what makes sema i got goosebumps guys i don't know if you that's weird right uh, but it's just to see someone excel in an industry and to start from nothing and to get there and then be on the Netflix show and then have basically the things and the goals and the desires that you're trying to strive for yourself and to see someone make that happen for themselves. That's awesome. I've only been here an hour, guys. Maybe two. It's going to be a good day. Huh. So, What's up, everybody? Here we go. We got John, the founder of the. Mi you are like, you did all this by yourself, didn't you? Try it. Yeah. Try it. Yeah. I've got a business right. Now you have a team. Yeah, we've got but a good team. He's got a great Absolutely. team. But for you guys that don't know, Lux Automotive Film. Tan, how do you want to, what is your actual name? For? So we call it light wrap. Okay. It made the most sense. In the visual effects world, that means wrapping the background onto the foreground character, yeah. but in our world, light wrap means wrapping the light. Yeah. I mean, that's it. And since it's not a tin product, it's a wrap product, it only made sense. Yeah. So, you guys know, I have this on my car. I have it on the custom headlight that I did with the knifeless tape and then the full rear tail lights and third brake light. And if y'all follow him, man, you see some crazy things they're doing. Like, check this out. It's actually some of our team in Japan here installing on a Ferrari. Is that light? Yeah, that's light smoke. Yeah. yeah. I'm trying to tell through my sunglasses and through, For sure, <laughs> through no the problem. screen. I'm just like, yeah. oh, I can't tell. It These looks are all light. available on YouTube as well. So. All on YouTube, his website, <laughs> Lux Auto Concepts. Lux Auto Concepts. Lux Auto Concepts. Net. Auto Concepts. Net. Go pick us up. This is by far the yeah. easiest and most user-friendly light wrap that I've used. Uh, prior to your company, I did use Vivid. Since I've used yep. yours, I've not touched another Vivid product alone. So it is very easy, it's very forgiving. Um, I wouldn't suggest trying a lot of complex things your first time, but it is very forgiving, man. Give it a give it a try. And you know, it's just taking the scene by storm. Absolutely, you know, we've got it for the do-it-yourselfer, we've got it for the professional. So yeah. no matter which way you want to get your lights tinted or you want to tint them yourself, you can do it with my room. Yeah, and you don't just have the smoke, you actually have designs and everything now. So you have the honeycomb, you have the, the stealth look for the matte finish. I mean, there's just all sorts of really cool things you can do with this product. Yeah. And I mean, people are using it on uh, the chrome deletes, making it look like a uh, like a, a dark shadow chrome. chrome, shadow is what chrome. We call it. Yeah, Shadow Chrome is one good, useful um, thing with the product. Another one that we're finding right now is a lot of people are using it for windshield banners. So for the top of your windshield, if you want that satin black look, you can do it with light wrap. You still get satin black, but you can see the red light through it. So you don't have to have your head ducked down. You know, that makes a lot of sense because I have Absolutely. the 5% eyebrow, and you really can't see that yeah. light through it. That's well, with adding carbon fiber out front, now yeah. you have a carbon, and it's awesome from inside the carbon. It looks carbon fiber also. Yeah, so, so you can really see through cool it. That, uh, that's really neat. I haven't even seen any of the people. We have that. people trying a lot of crazy things. Jeep soft tops and like yeah. soft top convertible windows. You can tint it with light wrap. Ah, there you go. Wild so, things. Give I mean, it a shot. You never. Look like at that, guys. Man, go check him out. Check out his Instagram. Check out the website. I'll put a link below. I'll put this Instagram tag. And uh, man, John, I love what you're doing. Man. I appreciate it, man. Thanks, I met man. him at Wham. 
Well, I guess it was last year still. Was it last year or the yeah, year before? Yeah, I met you at Friday Night Lights. Inside? So I met you at Friday Night Lights right. because I was out there and you asked me about the headlights on my <laughs> 300. Sure thing. And uh, since then, I mean, I've stayed in contact with him. I'm actually a registered installer for the company. Um, yeah, if you're in the DFW area and you need install. Right <laughs> yes. right here. There we go. Sure. Awesome, man. I appreciate it, John. Place your yeah. man, buddy. That's awesome. say about Steve and Yanti. Hey, Here at the Avery Denison booth where they're doing the, I'm assuming they're doing the Rap King battle, which is really cool. Um, if you ever get to check out the booth and see them, you get a bunch of different teams that come. And only one team can win. <laughs> and there's the man Justin Pate himself with the Rap Institute. I know Justin's working. I would really like to talk to him. Uh, I've chatted with him a few times here and there through email. Uh, I've been meaning to get together with him and speak with him in person. He goes out to Carrollton a lot, which isn't too far. He goes out to a buddy mine shop. Uh, I really would like to meet him and talk to him and try to pick his brain. But I don't think I'm going to be able to today because he's busy. <laughs> So what they're trying to do here is match up that center with the hook line. Yeah, that's what it's doing. You see when you have a full team, a team of four people that help you out, it, uh, it makes things a lot easier. For those of y'all who watch me wrap my bumper, wrap my bumper in the garage, two people is, is okay, but four is better. Coming up right here. So I could sit here and record these guys rap all day because it's very intriguing to me since I enjoy rapping myself. Um, go check out Rap Institute. Justin Pate does a lot of tutorials. He has a YouTube, even if you go to the Avery Dennison YouTube channel, uh, he does a lot of stuff. So very, very informative channel. Uh, does a lot of how-tos and stuff. I actually learned a lot. I learned to rap on YouTube, guys. Like I just went ahead and did a lot of studying block material and decided to wrap my own stuff like that's how I got started rapping so for any of you guys who've seen me rap you can do it too patience spend the money on the wrap try on your vehicle try on a panel try on something you know uh, it's fun it's tedious
So KPMF has some really cool colors. Uh, I think they have, in my opinion, some of the best gloss colors. I have yet to actually install any of the, the real gloss ones. Everything we keep doing is matte finish with customers. And uh, oh, you're so awesome. She was able to get me a color swatch for KPMF, which is kind of hard to come by. And now I get to pick it. Funny thing is one of these colors is what I was gonna do my car. I still might do my car in that color one day, but we will see. Who knows? I don't know what I'm doing with my car anymore. We're at the Oracle, and uh, we have more people. That looks like a fun bumper to do with that deep recess area and it is one piece. So we got the Chemical Guys booth. Y'all know uh, I use a lot of Chemical Guys stuff, especially since they opened the location by the house about a year ago, the detail garage. The problem, I was gonna buy a hat and a shirt, but it's cash only. So now I gotta run into someone I know and get some cash so I can get a shirt and a hat because uh, their shirt's really cool. Now we're gonna head over to Ceramic Pro. Let's see if my buddy Travis is over here. Um, let's just go ahead and see what they got going on, man. Uh, I met these guys a couple years ago, and I know a few installers in the DFW area, and they're all killing it, man. This is a great coating. There's a, I have a few detailing friends, and they all use different coatings, and I can't really be biased to any of them. Super stoked to have just met the U.S. distributor for TechRap. So I'm actually really excited. They have a color that I really want to do. So I, man, I may or may not change my whole damn car before we are Mopar. If I can get a good price on that wrap. Oh, I'm stoked, man. Today's a good day, guys. Today is clearly a wrap and detail day. <laughs> that I'm just gonna stay in this hall all day. And uh, I'm just, actually, I'm wait. I need to call Brandon. I need to figure out where a buddy of mine is and catch up with him. He does some YouTube and some podcasts and stuff. Let's see where he's at. Let's just see where the day takes us. So, y'all guys don't know Rap Sesh on YouTube. What's y'all out of Arizona, right? Yeah, Arizona. Yeah, Arizona. I actually have a lot of friends in Arizona area. Oh. <laughs> Mesa, Arizona. If y'all, man, check out their YouTube or even their Instagram page, man. Y'all are always showing DIYs and tutorials oh, and yeah. how they're doing stuff. They're always, y'all make me think I'm doing, like, I'm working way too hard, especially with <laughs> ta tanks and stuff. Yeah. I actually love the way they do that, man. If y'all are looking for any, like, tutorials or whatever, I know I just showed y'all Justin Pate and stuff, man, but y'all are amazing. Like, I just stopped them in the crowd and I was like, I know you, like, it's so <laughs> we do the, We do the laid, it's, we're pretty laid back with the videos, you know, yeah. we're just, got, and we whatever comes in the shop, that's what we're filming. That's the thing. Yeah. I, I, that's why I love y'all's YouTube videos, It's y'all are just... Real. Yeah, like, it's all, it's all whatever's like, happening in our shop. Yeah. So. <laughs> so great. Phoenix area, man, y'all check them out. Check out their YouTube and Instagram anyway. Thank you so much. Yes. Like, ah, <laughs> that's a good day. All right. So here at the 3M booth, you'll see laying down the knife list today. Hey, brother. 
So I did that whole little section in one of my previous videos about the knifeless tape and how much it's super beneficial, especially if it's directly on paint, if you're doing a certain kind of either graphic or like I did on my door jams to tuck in further than I needed to to try to cover more white. Um, they're doing it around the whole perimeter to, uh, it looks like around the moldings and the weather stripping to keep from getting a blade against that which is very useful for that as well. But you can also use it to do designs uh, or you know special cuts to have a very specific special cut. Um, very great, or tri-lines. I did uh, stripes with the tri-lines as well. That is a super cool route. This is printed on carbon fiber. Steven Blue Star Auto Salon out of Seattle. Championship details right here. Oh. Handing With out the L's. <laughs> there it is, baby. Makes for right here, right here. Self-proclaimed. So I'm over here at the Angel Wax booth area. With uh, my man, Brandon. <laughs> I like your content, it's good. So we've been over here chit-chatting about, so he's from DFW, he does a lot of detailing work. I mean, you wanna go ahead and tell him what you do? Or you yeah, to, uh, absolutely, man. We just it. kind of, we do things to enhance um, people that we care about, we, you know, their vehicles. So we'll kind of reach out, see if they want something like a ceramic coating or uh, film work or tent, we do a video about it. And when we do that, we kind of help both parties. So we get a little bit more training, we get some content, they get a good deal, some good work, and uh, we kind of film it. We're gonna see where that goes. I don't know where it's gonna go. So that's what me and him have been talking about behind the scenes. We've been talking about trying to collaborate together and do some video Rap. efforts with some wraps and with some detailing, and then try to see where we can take it through YouTube which should be fun, which should bring you guys a lot of content. A lot of content, it's, I'm not real into the detail world, so I'm gonna get to learn a lot, and I'll be able to learn that with you guys by showing you guys through YouTube. And same thing with him, you know, he does raps, uh, I do raps, so we'll be able to link together and do some cool stuff. I wouldn't say I do raps. Well, <laughs> we're gonna find out. We'll, we'll work together. So, I mean, it works. I know a little bit about detailing, I know the concepts, I know the process, I just. We have just about the entire industry behind us, so we'll figure it out. So it's fun, I'm gonna, I, we're, like I said, we've been talking and we're kind of curious and we're looking forward to seeing where this can go by mixing the two and uh, getting a lot of YouTube content. Just, Absolutely. it'll be fun, so stay tuned. We'll see what, we'll figure this out. <laughs> All right guys, so this video ended quite abruptly. Uh, I apologize for no real content leading towards the end. That group that I was hanging out with, with the, the detailing group of guys was, uh, I met a lot of new people. So we all just got to bullshit and hanging out, talking about things, and I was learning new things about detailing and that aspect. Then we all went out and grabbed a bite to eat, thinking we were gonna go back to the show, and we didn't, we're all full. We had a lot of pizza, which was delicious. But now, you can see, I got the link behind me, the high roller Ferris wheel, if you would. Observation wheel is what it's called, I think. And my hotel's back over here. I'm at the Flamingo. And that's it for today, guys. Today was completely wraps and detailing, which was really cool. I didn't, I, I didn't plan that at all. It's just, that is how today ended up. Uh, there is a wrap after party tonight which is really cool. I got to talk to some people and I forgot about that whole after party tonight. Now, I should be going to that, which I'm not gonna be recording. I'm just gonna be networking, talking to people, hanging out, having a good time. But that's it for today, guys. 
If you like this video, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. No idea what we're doing, but see you guys then. Peace.